March 19, 1943, the German High Command gathers in silence, staring at a monster of steel. Its name was Schwere Gustav, or as soldiers called it, Dora. This wasn't just a gun. It was the largest caliber, rifled, weapon ever built in human history. A railway cannon, so massive that it could fire, a shell weighing seven tons. Capable of smashing through 30 feet of concrete, or 1,000 millimeters of steel armor. Each shot needed a four-ton shell, and when it roared, the sound could be heard for miles. But Dora was more than a weapon. It was a symbol of the Nazi obsession, with super weapons machines, so colossal, they seemed pulled from a nightmare. Built by Krupp Industries, the gun required over 4,000 men just to operate and protect it, and an entire railway system to move it into position, its purpose, to obliterate the defenses of Sevastopol in 1942, where it did exactly that, reducing fortresses to rubble. Yet, for all its terrifying size, Dora represented the contradictions of war, massive effort, limited effect. Its shells destroyed bunkers, yes, but it could never change the outcome of the war. Today, no piece of Dora survives intact. It was dismantled by allied forces to prevent it from ever being used again. This photo, frozen in time, reminds us of the lengths humanity once went to create destruction when genius was turned not to saving lives, but to ending them. Subscribe for more lost clicks from the past.